versus Valera. Watch your back. All right. Begin. I don't know. So let me see. I mean, you. I really like to keep. Wait. Audio. Test. 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 Up my audio is fine. Anyways, um, usually I like to keep low tab no matter what. Um, it's probably right to keep really. Then I have like a turn free play. Could be too greedy, but this matchup is really hard. It's probably the hardest matchup. So I keep low tab no matter what. Like the. I have only warp spinner as one, one drop. The two drops don't have like the biggest impact in this matchup. So, but this is like a very, very important card to have. Mm. And like, yeah, like he has the coin, coin aside to kill um, a two drop. So having the juggler here or something could be really bad for me. So Misha is definitely the best one, Lyok is fine, because he still has to kill it. Mm, there could be Backstep SI coming out this turn. Then I can Quickshot Mad Scientist, which is pretty good. So he used already one Backstep. Backstep is a big threat. I like, I just, if he has it, I, I need him to get it out. There could be like yeah. Deadly Poison Evis Raid coming out or something. It should be pretty easy like for Rogue. But I need him to I need to force him to use the removal. So he doesn't have it with the Violet Teacher. If he goes Violet Teacher plus Prep Evis Raid, uh, it's gonna be a super hard game. That's where I need the Lotta, but it's really slow. Wow, it's already a 6-6. Six, six. Um, that's why I like a Hunter Smug as well. It's like pretty good. Yeah, that's uh, obviously a big threat. I don't know how I'm gonna kill it. To be honest, I wonder. I wonder. I wonder. I could quick shot it, but if I draw hunter's mark, when it shows, I don't have an answer for it. Now, if you would trade, um, I can unleash. Unleash plus mid scientist also trades. Also, just the explosive trap would kill it. Looks like I'm not gonna go for my lot next turn. The thing is, if he has a wild or something, like even if I draw a hunter's mark, it's not bad. So, I stayed mana fish on last so turn. Yeah, definitely a tough matchup. Pretty bad hand as well. The rack is good in this matchup, but very slow. And double unleash is usually also very bad. So I expect explosive here. Like, I don't want to make it too obvious with the unleash. It's alright. Just to keep him guessing. Might just go phase and then have still my leash. It's fine. Even if he gets the three or four damage, should be fine. It's good if he plays for his way. Or fan of knives. Yeah. Like using the dagger like that, just to put on the keeper. Like even the lot tab is pretty good here because he has to like trade. Oh my god! Do I actually have find new use? I really kind of like the lot tab here actually. I mean, red scale is not bad. Like if he has to face tank it, that's just really good. The rack might actually even kill him. Push for 7 damage here. 
I mean, the dress code isn't bad, but it's like, hmm. I still have double unleash as burst damage. I don't have kill commands. I used one quick shot. Burst damage is limited. This still has to deal with it. Still have like. Zap's kind of this. So if he oils this one, I can still like dread skin. Like I'm also pretty low, and he has the board. He has 8 damage on board. But he cannot ignore my minion. Could have eviscerated. If you would trade, it would be like insane for me. I wonder. Like in a hunter smug would be just so or like a or tracking into a hunter smug. Mm. It's like very difficult like what to do like um, with my hand and sports days and stuff. Because I'm, I should be controlling the board, or try at least, but at this end it's very difficult and I, even if I kill the Shredder with the Dread Scale, I don't know what pops out. Okay, that's obviously really good for me. Shrek's now doesn't really do anything. I could Dreadscape plus Belcher, which is not awful. Could uh, Unleash plus Belcher. Dreadscape into Hunter Smug. I mean, to Earth Tracking into Hunter Smug, but it's only Hunter Smug, which is pretty good. I still have the Belcher up, which he has to kill. He used one Zap already. Mm. If he has another Zap, I'm probably dead. Maybe he just a sprint. Yeah, yeah it's the sprint. I can I quickly. Yeah. That should be definitely good for me. Except if I survive. No, it's all about does he have another zap? Does he have lethal? He could have it. If he doesn't have a, like he used both Blade Furies, if he doesn't have a Zapper, he should survive. Question is... Because he doesn't have the Dagger. He usually they have like Sprint and Minions. Like that. Okay, that. Still like a powerful board. But yeah, double spell power is definitely scary. There's no fan on this. Okay. Am I forced to YOLO rack? F8, 9, 11. That should be lethal rain. 6, 7, 7. I wonder. No, it's not. Acceptable. I think I can. Time for some skill. Easiest game of my life. I think like when you have, you definitely go for the 30 percent of winning the game. Uh, you can track for lethal rain. Prep should be good. 
I don't know, to be honest. I definitely, there's a way of going. Like, this is definitely a combination to kill me. He doesn't have Blade Furies, though. So, it's n he still has to kill my guy without backstab. He used Fan already. No Flurries. And he used Pump Prep already. So, he definitely... I mean, obviously, Double Eviscerate kills me. I mean, it's not obviously for because he's thinking so hard, but... Oh, maybe he just has to flood the board here. It's a crazy interesting game. Really close game, but really nice game, so.